Buongiorno everyone. Um, early, early hours here in Auckland. Um, the weather seems reasonable, so I'm gonna go out for a bike ride. First things first, a bit of stretching. And the next thing is coffee. During this quarantine period, um, I've been lucky to sort of escape and come, come back to New Zealand. And to be honest, I've been pretty boring, doing a lot of training and reading a few books, probably the opposite of what you'd expect from a racing driver. But um, yeah, it's been a good opportunity to just sort of settle down and do all the things that I haven't really had the chance to do in the past year and a half, or since I started in the FDA. You probably don't know this, but um, <laughs> I don't eat meat. So I know what you're thinking. You're thinking that I'm jumping on the Lewis Hamilton bandwagon of being vegan and whatnot, but really I just don't like the taste that much of meat. So I just decided I'd try and cut it out of my diet, but I'm not fully vegetarian or whatever. I just, you know, plant-based, let's say. Um, one of my earliest memories of Ferrari would have to be uh, getting up in the middle of the night in New Zealand and watching the Grand Prix with my dad. My dad was a massive Michael Schumacher fan, um, so he was always pushing hard for him. And uh, I was a Kimi Raikkonen fan right from the beginning. And when Kimi signed for Ferrari in 2007 and won the Melbourne Grand Prix uh, in his first race, that was like my heaven. <laughs> As you can imagine, a young seven-year-old Marcus. Um, so that was pretty cool, and that's probably my, my earliest memory of, um, of Ferrari. Also pretty lucky to have a sauna. So I come here pretty much every day before dinner and sweat it out. So now my brother James is having a go in the sim. How's it going, Jimmy? Well, my phone went down. You've ruined it. Oh, no. Well, you were only 10 seconds off anyway, so no stress. Paris, you, you're loving, you loving life? Hi, guys. We're um, off to dinner, so see you guys oh, later. Yeah. Okay. So, it's, I don't know what time it is right now, New Zealand time, but I have a race to do in approximately one hour, so I'm not sure how it's going to go because I can barely keep my eyes open. Um, it's game on here.